at the age of 14, I had my son, Daniel. After I had my son, I had to be a parent. And I didn't necessarily know how to do that. So I resorted to partying, drugs, and drinking, and all that stuff to really cope with life. And um, there was an incident where I got stabbed. That was really the, the point for me where I had to really change things around. I got involved with the United Way through a program that I joined for single moms. They taught us how to manage our money, how to save better. It can help you get your priorities straight. It can help you get full-time employment. And it teaches you life lessons that you can really pass on onto your kids. I've gotten myself back into post-secondary and going to George Brown for um, fashion styling. Two years ago, I wouldn't even have had this as an option. As young mothers, we, we may not be perfect ourselves, but we can give them a better life. I'm a lot happier now. I've, I've learned a lot, I've come a long way, I think. So when your hearts, your soul, your spirit, your mind and emotions are finally set to flight, will it be on an angel spread or winds of darkness? Regardless, you speak. I was a really weak person. I was a really weak character. I didn't care about other people. I didn't care about myself. I didn't have hopes. I didn't have dreams. I didn't have aspirations. The person that, that I was headed to become, yeah, I was in a pretty picture. It seemed natural, I guess, to go into the criminal activity because that's what we saw around us. That was the environment. If I saw somebody with a gun, it felt normal. For all I know, I could have even been sitting down in jail right now. What could I say? What could I really do that, that could change someone's life, that could change somebody? Because I felt my opinion didn't matter. It's me feeling that I didn't have a voice. When the United Way came in and showed me that I did, that was a huge turning point for me. I started to realize that my words had value, my words had power. So every time I would speak, I would gain more confidence. And that just started to, to bring out such a joy within me. I remember the first time I, I wrote a, a spoken word piece and everything just started to flow from my heart. I spoke about the power and authority that words have because I realized how important that was personally to me. My passion was for people, particularly youth. So I want to become a high school teacher and I know the, the impact that a good teacher can do, that a good person can have in someone's life. And I want to be an active role model for something positive like education. That's where a lot of youth drop off. That's why it's so important for us to go back and give back to the community because it's important for us who have seen the benefits of the program to go back into the community. I know now that when I stand that people take note, that people notice, and that I don't stand alone, that I stand with others. I think the death of my mother was the turning point. I was miserable. I didn't go anywhere. I didn't talk to anyone. What would you call it? It's, it's not enjoying life. Not like that anymore. I won't allow my depression become an issue. When out of this world came and very pushed that we said, yeah, you can work. And you are instrumental. And then you're just, just not a sickness. You're a human being. The cafe, it's just not a job to me. It's more than that. I think it's more to every single one of us. It's a lifeline. You know, they helped us by paying for their managers and the supervisors and for the equipment. Without them, we wouldn't be able to run this cafe at all. When I first started, I started into the kitchen. Then my boss says to me, he wanted me to do the cash. He said, yeah, I think you can do it. Now I teach it. Out of this world and United Way taught me to be responsible. I'm out of the house eight hours a day. I'm communicating with other people. I smile more. I'm something that I wasn't before. I, I want people to say, yeah, we have an illness, but we're human, that we're capable of working. 
reception of people with mental illness is that they didn't think we couldn't work. And we won't have as many hospitalizations because we're doing something to better ourselves. And to better ourselves, we were better for our community. In any way, it changed me by giving me the tools that I need to change my life. It's helped me to really make me a better person. United Way to me is it's a lot of people coming together saying that I want to make a difference, saying I want to make a change. United Way to me is a lifesaver. You can be anything you want to be if you set your mind to it.